Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty. Our life has just improved. Season four, week three challenges have dropped. And they call them challenges. And you saw, if you looked at the introductory snippet there correctly, I completed six out of seven in the first game. The seventh, I got four fifths completed and it was done early in the second game. So I don't know what the word challenge means to them, but I guess we'll take it. Let's talk about strategy. We're going to plan our flight and fly our plan. We're only going to need three weapons. The KVD Enforcer for Marksman Rifle, the Renetti with a jack kit on it for the handgun, and the Puel Miat 762 to complete the LMG challenge. You'll need the 200 round mag. Now, if you count up all the kills and the challenges, it appears you need 150 gags. But really, with all the combinations you can do, you can do five bell rings with one gag. So really, you only need 40 to complete the entire week three challenge set. So what about strategy? I broke the challenges down into two groups, aptly named group one and group two. 40 kills while moving with a recommended weapon. Weapon. Well, the KVD Enforcer is recommended. 20 while using a completionist camo. That's the forged, the gilded, the interstellar in my case, and that other sparkly one. 15 Gax while using covert sneakers. Equip your class with covert sneakers. 20 tax stance kills with a recommended marksman rifle. That's where the KVD Enforcer comes in. Guess what we're going to be doing? We're going to be moving in covert sneakers while we're gacking in tax stance with a KVD Enforcer. Five attachments equipped to that KVD because the next challenge says get 20 gacks with five attachments to a marksman rifle or a battle rifle. So there's five for one for the first challenge, and then get three double kills with a COR-45 or Renetti handguns. I chose the Jack-equipped Renetti. Here's the configuration I use for the KVD Enforcer. I'm not going to go into deep dive, but there it is in case you want to screenshot it. And here's the configuration for the Renetti with the Jack Ferocity Carbine Kit equipped. Let's look at group two challenge. It's not even an S on it because we've already gotten six of them completed. Get three operator GAX with one magazine five times with a recommended LMG. I use the Pool Miat 762. I hope I said it right. If you know how to say it, let me know. I got four out of five of those done in the first game after I, I completed the other six. So you'll probably do better than me. But in any case, here it is. And this is the configuration. Now the reward is the Jack Scimitar kit, and here's what it does for you. Significantly increases the ranges, significantly increases recoil control. This thing will drive a nail at a 500 paces at a slight cost to mobility and handling. ADS speed impacted significantly, but it's still less than 240 milliseconds for that kind of power. And the sprint to fire speed is still less than 175 milliseconds. So overall, you're getting an accurate, far-reaching weapon at the cost of a bit of your mobility and handling. Here's a preview, preview of the Jack Scimitar equipped to the Horus. I'm not trying to control recoil. So you can see it is very accurate. So let's take the challenges to the enemy here and go out in the field and see how the strategy worked for the completion of the week three season four challenges. Let's go get it done. All right, we're going for the five challenges in the upper left corner of, the, of your screen. And we can see we lit up four of them. The fifth isn't tracked. So make sure that you track five at all times. I'm tracking five, just not that fifth one. And there I am, tax stance, moving, marksman rifle, five attachments, covert sneakers, with a completionist camo. Did I already say that? 
Luckily, I got shipment. I always go with the small map mosh pit unless I need long shots. And the gentleman, Tommy Chong, just happened to step in front of me. I see people stepped in paint. They have pink footprints or purple, whatever that color is. And there, 15 covert sneakers. Very, like, first quarter or so of the game. So we're going to have to step up the gacking. There we have Green Man laying down so that it made it easier for me to gack him. There's the Purple Veiled Nun. And we're just continuing to move and gack. Attack stance. Five attachments. I just really don't know what they were thinking on these challenges. I wonder if anybody that even plays the game reviews them. And there we are, completionist camo, 20 gax. And five attachments, 20 gax. And there we are with 20 tax stance gax. Okay, so now we pull out the Renetti. We're still going for 40 moving and three double kills. There was the first one. Willing to sacrifice Grandpa's tired body to light up the scoreboard. Gotta love it. So the first four are already completed. There's a double kill. Just need, I think, one more with the Renetti. Same game. There, somebody lays down to give it to me. Oh, I guess I needed one more. And there it is. So the fifth challenge is completed in this first game. And we now have the Jack Scimitar. We're looking for 40 moving and three kills with one mag five times. So there's the pull, pull me out, 762. There's a triple kill, so that for sure counts. And by the way, I still had 175 rounds left in my magazine after that triple kill. There we are kind of sleezing a little bit, but when you need to get three, you do it however you can. Got that purple veil, none, two kills in a row. There she went sliding by again. And there are the 40 operator kills moving. Now all we need are the three kills, one mag, five times with an LMG. And as it turns out, when this game ended, I had four of those five. So I had six and four-fifths of the challenges completed. You can probably get seven. And there I am getting executed. There they are. Man, I was pretty happy about that. I, in fact, I couldn't believe it. Now I just need one. Second map. Two. And... Where's the third? Where's the third? I'm going to sleaze in this corner till I get the third. Cheesing it. There's three. And I deserve the death. But that was a great game. And there, all seven are completed. We win. Fantastic on both sides. Hey, week seven challenges are easy. You should go ahead and go for them because the scimitar, I've already used it. And it's an outstanding attachment. Please like and subscribe. Peace to you.